Ladies and gentlemen, have a wonderful first day here in Antarctica. Uh, be sure to uh, dress up warmly and enjoy. He was not arrested, but we asked him to leave the booth and to leave the fair, and we have his contact and everything, so we can go. We can go further, but. I don't think I don't think we will. So uh, maybe if my music attracts younger people, it, it'll be a good opportunity uh, for them to know about uh, like the uh, the Buddhism. Tropical winemaking is really up and coming. A lot of people, uh, a lot of winemakers from around the world, they want to know what we do here because um, the climate is changing and so uh, they have to adapt to warmer temperatures, higher rainfalls in their regions too. You know, if you step on even the grass here, the security asks you to leave. But yeah, I think now they get to know us because we keep coming here. So they start feeling that we're playing safe, we're not doing anything wrong. So yeah, I think it's getting famous more and more. For example, I can't show clearly a bottle of my wine. I can't post on social media what the wine tastes like, how or why it's good. And also there's a restriction in the form of excise tax. When, uh, when I come to here and I feel like uh, uh, I am king, huh? and you know, the, the Parao, huh? king of the Egypt. We are also increasing the awareness of our guests on the problematic of climate change, for example, and on, on all the many changes that are taking place. whatever rainfall that uh, we receive throughout the year, but then it just flows off. We cannot tap them. We cannot even harness those waters. We don't have that uh, proper system of uh, harnessing the rain.